Tuesdays are the only night for high school football. Cedar Rapids Kennedy was one of eight teams across the state to kick off their season with a little Saturday night action as the Cougars face Dowling Catholic in a ranked showdown. Jack Lito has more from Kingston Stadium. Here at Kingston Stadium, Kennedy has an early test. They're welcoming in a central Iowa school and one of the state's best in Dowling Catholic. Earlier this week, I was speaking to head coach Brian White. He referenced the phrase, iron sharpens iron. Well, tonight, Kennedy will try to prove they can compete with the sharpest. Kennedy captains coming out ready for that big test. Dowling proving why they are a top five team. They force a Kennedy punt, then they drive it down the field. Rashad Davis with a three-yard scamper. That plus a field goal makes it 10-0 Maroons. But JFK with a big play. Vincenzo Gianforte going to the air, and he links up with Cyrus Courtney in stride. Red zone chance for Kennedy. That leads to the play-action fake. Gianforte to Braden Alber, and the junior puts his head down and gets to the big box, and it's a three-point game. Dowling, though, with an instant response. Davis gets the kickoff and he's going all the way to the other end. It's a maroon touchdown. Got to be deflating for Kennedy. So how do they respond? How about another deep shot? This one's an absolute drop in the bucket. Courtney makes the catch again. Red zone trip and it sets up a seven yard toss to Calvin White, the middle linebacker playing a little fullback. Dowling scores again. It's 24-14 at the half. Kennedy gets the ball marching midway through the third and it's this connection again. Gianforte going up top to Courtney. Are you kidding me? Did he get that foot down? Back judge says yes. Touchdown, Cougars. 24-21, but the maroon wave has the Cougars swimming in deep water. Dowling just too much. The final is 38-21. No moral victories for the Cougars, but a strong starting point to be very proud of. But I think physically we can match up with them. What we have to do is we have to execute and be more disciplined. Um, that's where they were superior to us. It gives us a, a place to start with. If we want to see them again in November, we know what we need to do now the next eight weeks. Kennedy coming up a little bit short, but that was a fun matchup. Who knows? Maybe we'll see it again later in the state playoffs. Week one is over, and it's Saturday night, which means only six days till Friday Night Lights Week 2 edition. I can't wait. Reporting from Kingston Stadium, Jack Lito, KCRG TV9 Sports.